Yeah, I am expecting more sunshine this weekend, but I do have a small chance for a shower or a thunderstorm, so be careful with that top down as you head into tomorrow evening and tomorrow night. You don't have to worry about that tonight, though. Temperatures in the mid-60s. We did hit 84 this afternoon, and temperatures all across the region this evening are slowly dropping out of the 80s right into the 60s tonight all across northeastern Ohio and western Pennsylvania. Still close to 70 degrees, and it is 73 here at the station. 69 in the city of Warren, 64 in Lisbon, and 69 up in Cortland tonight. Dew point temperatures starting to climb, and this is going to make tomorrow feel more humid for you, especially as we go into the afternoon. Uh, now climbing up towards 60 degrees after they were in the 40s and 50s uh, for a big part of the week, and that's why these hot temperatures haven't been as bad as they were this past weekend. So tonight, uh, humidity tracker on the lower side. Tomorrow heading up toward that sticky to muggy category, especially tomorrow afternoon into tomorrow evening and tomorrow night. Sunday, not quite as humid because the storm system moving through will bring in some drier air on the back side of it. Tonight, just some clouds out there. That's all you have to worry about. I'm expecting dry weather overnight right into tomorrow. Uh, off to the northwest, though. This is a storm system I'll be watching closely as we go through the weekend, and Alex George will be here tomorrow afternoon and evening, uh, keeping an eye out for some of these thunderstorms to form as we go into the late afternoon and evening because the threat will be there. It's a small threat, but the threat is there right into tomorrow night. Here's future tracker tonight. You don't have to worry about showers or thunderstorms getting started tomorrow morning. Dry sunshine around filtered by some clouds. Temperatures climbing right up into the mid 80s by midday, upper 80s by afternoon. And as we go into three, four, five o'clock, an isolated shower or thunderstorm will be possible. A little better chance for that as we get into later tomorrow evening and early tomorrow night, 9, 10, 11, 11 o'clock, the risk will be there for a shower or storm as this system drops on through and then some of that drier weather will try to build in into Sunday. Now I am leaving a small risk for an isolated shower or storm in on Sunday. It's a pretty small chance right now. Temperature is slightly cooler and less humid than Saturday, but the chance will be there until we wrap up the weekend and then we dry right back out early next week and the temperatures, well, they continue to climb. 60 tonight, a few clouds, not as cold. Tomorrow, temperatures climbing in the mid to upper 80s. More humid into the afternoon and evening with that risk of a shower or thunderstorm late day. A big part of the weekend stays dry, so I'm trying to uh, not scare you off with the raindrops out there, but the threat will be there uh, late Saturday into Saturday night and Sunday. Uh, mid 80s on Sunday. Here comes the heat. I mean, real heat this time. Upper 80s on Monday, near 90 Tuesday and Wednesday. And you may have heard me say this a few times this week. We have not hit 90 degrees since September 11th of 2013. So it's been a long time since we hit those 90s. We could touch that by the middle of the week. The next chance of showers and storms late Wednesday into Thursday. And that's unlike this area, right? Usually we get. Well, we typically right? get into the 90s. It's yeah. just we had a really cool summer yeah. last summer, and this summer being as wet as it's been, it's been tough to hit it. All right. Thanks, Paul. Better by the